Hi everyone, good morning. This is The Unspeakable at Innerscapes Art Studios and today I am painting from my friend's porch in Colorado. So this is Gold Bond Ultimate Healing Hand Lotion, family size. And the second ingredient in here is dimethicone. So I don't have any silicones. I do have this and I'm going to rub this into the cup. I know, I'm, I'm being inventive here. I do have only 20 minutes before the sun comes up and makes incredibly strong shadows on the porch. So I have to paint and not think, using my intuition again. So I suppose that's why I do this, for a few moments of color and not really thinking, choosing on attractiveness, what the materials at hand, and it's kind of a fantasy moment because nothing here is um, essential for life, but it is essential for my spirit to be with color. Isn't that interesting? And I love these colors. I love how they come out of the bottles so bright and yummy. And the paint doesn't always do what I want, especially when it's paints that I haven't used and paints that I don't have the appropriate materials for. But still, there's something childlike and exciting about pouring color out of a cup. So here I am allowing myself to really feel for 20 minutes my inner innocence, which is not really available in most of my life. I have to be smart and on target, get things done, take care of my responsibilities. But in this moment, I do not. And it's so joyful. Although, I do feel the adult creeping in and making decisions. Like, oh, that's a sky. Or, oh, this color belongs here. Or, oh, I should do this or I should do that. And I've learned through this process to notice those thoughts, but not really give them any weight or any attention and just come back to the kinesthetic and visual sense of color and paint flow. And another reason that I like to do this is I like to see how the environment I'm in and what I've been doing since the last painting influences the painting and comes in. Okay, you can see that the sun is starting to come over and I have to stop. It's going to make huge, great shadows. Well, I didn't actually stop. The camera was held up on a pole by a bungee cord and the bungee cord popped, the camera casing popped, and it dropped into the paint. So I had to swipe a little bit with the piece of parchment paper. And here it is. I like the swipes. I like the mid-tones of the swipes. And I like the three distinct rhythms going on here. Like you would like a finger painting, but it's a poor painting. So I like the colors, the Halloween, the fall colors, and the crazy sky, and I love the midtones of the swipes. What I did was I popped it into Procreate to see what my spirit would do with it, and I blended out the sky and I added some lines and cropped it and it looks like what it feels like to hike up in the high sage desert up here. So tell me what you think, which one you like better. Thank you for joining me. I'll see you soon.